at 10. Good evening, I'm Estefania Safer. Daniel and Natasha have the night off. El Paso drivers, as more projects begin on our roads, get ready for more closures with the start of the new tech stop project underway. KTSM 9 News reporter Stephanie Shields, live in central El Paso. Some of these murals here in Lincoln Park will no longer stand as a new tech stop project begins to connect parts of I-10 and the US-54 to the border highway. Right now, we're on the cusp of traffic getting unmanageable in El Paso. The I-10 Connect project is adding additional connecting ramps to improve access between I-10 and Loop 375. This should help the traffic during construction projects along the freeway. It's crucial right now because we need to do some work on I-10. We've just finished the Reimagine I-10 study. We have some projects coming out of that corridor study, and we need ways to get people off of I-10 while we're working on I-10. Drivers can expect closures on I-10, the US-54, and Paisano. You'll also see an impact on surface streets around the Spaghetti Bowl and detours in that area. Motorists told KTSM they are not looking forward to more closures. Sometimes I'll be stuck in traffic over here for an hour, and it's just so frustrating. It'll take me maybe an hour and a half to get to the, to the east side. The project will also remove 10 of the columns bearing murals in Lincoln Park, but TxDOT says it will preserve five and provide new columns to create future murals. TxDOT says this project will ease traffic congestion in the long run. We do always have congestion, for example, uh, right around the Spaghetti Bowl. That's one of the highest trafficked areas in El Paso. It's one of the 200 most congested roadways in the state. The I-10 connection pro project is underway, and you'll begin to see some of those overnight closures starting on March 3rd. For a full list of closures and what you can expect from this project, you can head to our website, ktsm.com. Live in Central El Paso, Stephanie Shields, KTSM 9 News. Thank you, Stephanie. And of course, the new I-10 Connect project is just the latest tech stop project.